Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Sharani. Today I'll be showing you how I make Belizean rice and beans. I'm starting off with my pot over medium heat and I'm adding some coconut oil to that. I'm using my Belizean coconut oil. That's why I have it in this container. But I like my Belizean coconut oil because it just tastes so different and smells different from the coconut oil I get here in the States. Belizean people will live out here know what they talk about. I'm adding some chopped onion to that. Chopped green bell pepper or as we say in Belize, sweet pepper. Give that a stir and let that cook 5 minutes just until the onion is starting to get a little brown. How I measure it is equal amounts of rice to beans. So I'm cooking 2 cups of rice and I'll measure out 2 cups of beans. I always like to wash my rice before I cook it. I know some people don't but it's up to you. Just wash it until the water runs clear. Now it's time to add my rice to the pot. to give that a stir and let that cook several minutes so it could get nice and toasted before I add the other ingredients. The beans I'm using is beans that I cooked in my crock pot yesterday. I like to cook beans ahead of time and just keep it in the refrigerator for whenever I need it. Um, I'll have a link at the end of this video for this beans recipe so you can check that out. Rice and beans is something everybody cooks on Sunday in Belize. We always have rice and beans with stewed chicken or pork, fried plantain and potato salad. I'm using one can of coconut milk for this recipe. Plus one cup of water. Oh yeah, and don't forget to put in your salt because I almost did. Since I'm using beans that is already seasoned, I don't need to put a lot of salt. I'm giving it a taste just to make sure everything is just how I like it. After this comes to a boil, cover it and lower the heat and I have mine set on 2, it's almost to the lowest setting. Cook that for 30 minutes and don't touch it. Don't uncover it, don't stir it, don't do anything. There is no need to do that. This is what it looks like 30 minutes later. And I'm just using a fork just to check the bottom and make sure 
that all the water has cooked out so now I'm turning off my stove and then I'm just gonna cover it back and leave it on the stove for 15 minutes when that 15 minutes is up then you take off the lid and use a fork to fluff the rice that's it perfect rice and beans all the time you don't have to worry about it sticking in the bottom burning or anything I promise you so for them Belizean people if you like rice bun well no need of this recipe <laughs> Well, I hope you like this recipe and give it a try. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to share the video, like the video. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Oh, and by the way, I have a Belizean potato salad recipe coming up next. So keep an eye out for that. But thanks again and talk to you in my next one. Bye.